Kane Williamson, a spectacular batsman. None come close to him, we cannot argue that, but there's one thing that sticks out like a sore thumb about him. It is his ability to win trophies or lack thereof. This is a career mode dedicated to Kane Williamson, where I will do my best to make sure he wins at least one trophy. This is Kane Williamson's road to redemption after losing 2015 World Cup as well as 2019 as a skipper and also losing the recent IPL. The man needs a break, and so I've decided to make it my duty to make sure by the end of this, he has got at least one trophy. It's going to be on Legend and Hardest, so wish me luck. Here we go. I'm Laughing Coyote, by the way, if you didn't know. First game in the IPL. Sunrisers, Hyderabad, Rajasthan Royals. Here's the coin toss. Rajasthan Royals, or Steve Smith, the skipper of Rajasthan Royals, have uh, chosen tails its heads instead and Mitch Marsh for some reason is the captain and Marshy boy picks well all fast so they've put up 160 some runs I'm not entirely sure uh, but it's our turn to bat and I think it's Kano's turn to bat there he is he's got a hundred can we get can we make that one into a two? Oh, by the way, here you go. So, don't minge after this. All right, there it is. Legend and hardest. All right, here we go. This first game did not start off too well as Kano decided to go for the leg glance of turds. And, well, he ended up being uh, a turd himself because uh, that's it. Just one run of five deliveries. Not a great start to the IPL. We're going to do our best to win the IPL trophy. And, uh, well, if we don't, then, um, yeah, we're not, you know, uh, we have the World Cup coming up. We'll try for that. Uh, we'll go all the way up until the World Cup. And, um, you know, we have two trophies uh, on the line to win, two chances. And we're going to do our best to uh, win at least one of them. Tails, it is Mumbai Indians or Hartik Pandya have won the toss. And he will be choosing two drum roll here we go ball first and uh oh pretty good start for sunrisers heather abad and now it's kano turn to bat here we go full toss not gonna fly not against kano as he smashes that one over extra cover for six runs 97 meters long bumra eats her heart out Kano is back he might have gotten out on one run in the first game but in this one well at least he's got six right of just one delivery for that something we're gonna try to get much more than that unfortunately that's not gonna be in this game as you can see that is the demise of Kano one for 11 of 8 at least his strike was above 100 this time around so overall not a great start and guess what Sunrisers have lost the game as well so that's not only bad for Kano himself but also Sunrisers chance and Kano's chances of winning a trophy. Sunrisers Hyderabad have won the toss. Mitchie, Mitch Mitcherson have chosen to have a bat first. Alrighty then, it's uh, Kano turn to bat coming in at number three, weighing it 200 pounds. I, I, I doubt he's 200 pounds. He, he's so skinny, he can uh, double his weight and probably still less than 200. Okay, that doesn't even make any sense, but here we go. Okay, first boundary of the day. He's gonna go for the leg glance of turds. Now it turns out if they don't have a fine leg, um, you know, like I do, I've got really fine legs. Anyways, uh, you can play the leg glance of turds and you'll have some success like that. You still won't hit a six even though you get two ideals. That should be a six, but uh, since it is the leg glance of uh, turds, you should be thankful that you're getting some runs at least. And Kano is on a matting as he's smashing everything out of the park. Oh, that was close. Close one, but he's safe. I think he's safe. Well, he should be at least. Here we go. He's gonna go for the leg glance of Tads again. Is that gonna be another four? Is it? Is it? Fielder coming in, and he stops it. Good fielding in the end, but Kano is resilient. He's gonna push for the third, and he does really well. That's another three right there. So that's six in a way, in two deliveries except one. And uh, 
That's the final delivery of the inning. So Kano will not get a 50, but he has got some runs under his belt and in very few deliveries as well, putting Sunrisers in a much better position than when he walked out in. Here we go. Oh, Kolkata is actually scoring really well. They might have just nicked it and they have. Kolkata won that game as well. And Sunrisers are, uh, well... They lost yet another game. So, Mitchy Mitch Mitcherson, that's his new name. If you didn't know, well, now you know. You're welcome. I've chosen to have a bat first. Brilliant. And uh, Kano's turn to bat. Will he get his first half tan here? Well, there he goes. Brilliant shot into extra cover, and that'll be four runs. Two ideals, yet still not six. That's the beauty of the hardest and legend difficulty. This time he goes on the onside over mid-wicket and gets another boundary. Unfortunately, there aren't going to be the incomplete 20 overs. As you can see, it's raining, and so they have uh, taken off one over from both the innings. I just hope they don't take another over off. Uh, Chris George is not looking too good. Well, I spoke too soon. Looky that. It's 15 overs now. And Kano have realized that. And guess what? He's gone for the aerial route. Boom. 92 meters long. 15 overs game. Bang, bang. Oh, yeah. That's more like it. Out of the stadium. Biggest one of the day. 137 meters on legend and hardest difficulty are you having that kano is really turning it on but again they are bowling full tosses let's be honest and those are the easiest deliveries in this game to put away there's another full toss are you kidding me that's not going all the way for six just short the one bounce and four runs and brilliantly hooked away into the gap that's the classy kano he can hit it hard, but he can use a bit of finesse as well. That deft touch he has, finding the gaps like that. Just a flick of the wrist. That is why he's one of the greatest batsmen in the world at the moment. None come close to him. And uh, it's for that very reason. He's very versatile. 49, he's on. Brilliant flick of the wrist over the inner circle field. End of the gap. Finds the rope. 50 up. First 50 of this year's IPL. 53 of 34 deliveries. Brilliant innings. But uh, is there more where that came from? Well, Kano thought so, but that will be his end. Yes, it is the fielder does hang on. Wasn't too sure. I thought, you know what? In this game, the fielder's drop catches way too often, so he might just drop it and Kano might get another chance. But no, not to be, not today at least. And uh, the Gale Storm struck. The Universe boss have got a big wicket here. Kane Williamson going for 53. And... Uh, yeah, oh no, Kings 11 Punjab won that one as well. So Kane Williamson, um, often uh, people refer to the Kiwis as chokers, which is a bit rude, but it is true, let's be honest. It's the Kiwis and the South Africans, the chokers of uh, international cricket. But Sunrisers have won the toss and chosen to have a bat first. So Kane Chokerson, I mean Williamson, well, will he fare today? Well, let's find out. Here we go. It's a free hit to start things off with. And there is no better way to deal with a free hit than go over the rope for the maximum result. And make the bowler think twice about bowling a short one to you next time. Look at that right out of the meat of the blade. Boom goes the ball over the road for six and he's hooked that one away it's not quite a six i don't think no it's not it's a couple of bounces but it is a boundary regardless and uh well he's not too happy the bowler shouldn't be uh oh try to smash that one unfortunately he's just nicked it we'll get a couple of runs so um yeah there you have it oh lovely dive dive for style points there at the end. Uh oh, that's not gonna. Yep, that. Yep. <laughs> when it when the marker is blue, uh, yeah, just go for it, mate. Just just go. Don't hold back, cause that's your chance of absolutely smashing it away. It's pretty much a boundary every single time, unless your timing is ridiculously bad, in which case, well, you can get out. But um, if you are semi good at the game, the full toss or the Yorker length should be a welcome sight to you as a batsman at least. 44, he's on. Is he on track? Well, he's definitely on track to get his second 50. Will he get it, though? That will be two in a row if he does. 
that would be a brilliant comeback. That is 50 banishing between the skipper and Weiss skipper. Well, in real life, at least. Not in the game. In the game, Mitchie Mitch Mitcherson is the skippy. And he's going back for the second one. Uh-oh. Okay. David Warner made it back. And there it is. Yet another 50. 50 of 36. Brilliantly done, Kano. He's been given a bit of room. As if he needs any help. He has been provided some assistance. And uh, well, he said thank you very much. And that is a hundred partnership up. Although the bulk of uh, work was done by David Warner. And like I said, when you get a full toss or a Yorko and delivery, go for it. Because it's pretty much a six or at least a boundary if there's no fielder on the rope. Every single time. And uh, it's proving so. There he goes. Gets a thick edge. But... Um, you know, fortune favors the bold, and Kane Williamson is pretty bold. Well, I th oh well, <laughs> the field is not that bold, or maybe he is. He took a chance, but uh, well, it's backfired, and that's a hundred up for uh, David Warner. And that's the end of the innings. That was the last delivery, by the way. If he hadn't scored that boundary there, he would have been left on 99. So that missed field has actually helped him. Super Kings have won, unfortunately. So Kano's 50 and Warney's uh, 100. Yeah, well, it's in vain. It's Mumbai Indians again, Hardik Pandya. What are you going to do this time? He's won the toss again. And he has chosen to have a bat first. All righty then. So, oh, the opener batsman got quite close to 100. Couldn't get over the line, though. Couldn't get into the triple digits. And Kano's turn to come into bat. Look at that, just 0 .01 away from 30 average. What a classy shot. That's what I'm talking about. That's why he's so good. If it's not big sixes over the roof, it's nice little daft touches like that. Look at that. That's what I'm talking about. First delivery, lovely back foot punch. Second delivery, 139 meters over the roof, out of the stadium, umpire. Bring the net, new, net, what? I, okay, I forgot how to speak. Bring the new box of bowls is what I meant to say, because that one is out of here. Sayonara, bowler, bowler? No, not bowler, bowl. Well, I guess you can say bowler as well. Lovely look at the wrist over the inner circle. And guess what? Four runs. Is he going to do it again? Oh, you bet your ass he's going to do it again. He's done it, and he's done it to perfection. And that's yet another boundary. And uh, now they're in a very comfortable position. David with another 100. And, well, unfortunately, Kane Williamson could not get a third 50 in a row. But uh, he was not out, though. That's another thing. He did not get out and uh, scored about 33 runs not out. Davey was very good, about 100. Well, well over 100, 128 or something like that. Here we go. Lokesh Rahul uh, have chosen to have a bat first. And, oh, it's not looking good. They've lost very quick wickets, and I don't think they've got too many runs on the board as well. Uh, let's see how... Okay, this is taking a bit longer than expected. Okay, there we go. Kano is in for a brilliant shot. Oh, my goodness, I thought he might get caught, but no, well, it's gone over. And that'll be four runs. Brilliantly done, Kano. Brilliantly done. Flick of the wrist. Beats the uh, square leg. No deep square leg. And so you know it. You know the drill. It's a 50. I mean, it's a boundary. <laughs> Lovely shot over mid off. Yet again from the brilliant Kane Williamson. The classy Kane Williamson. Textbook player he is. And uh, there he goes. Over extra cover this time. They have extra coverage and extra cover. And that is why he had to take the aerial route. He's taken the Joe route this time. And well, guess what? He's cleared the inner circle and four more runs for Kano. Okay, brilliantly done. That is too good. Too good indeed. Again, ideal timing. Yet it's not gone all the way for six. Brilliant, isn't it? They gotta love this game sometime. Well, it's just, you know, it's the difficulty. It's the hardest difficulty. So, uh, yeah. I love how Kano is coming out of his crease. Look at how far down the track he's standing. Look at that. He's not scared of you, mate. He ain't scared of you. You want some? He'll give it here. <laughs> Anyways, that is six boundaries back to back. Six fours in and over. The maximum amount you can get 
legally that is unless the bowler bowls a little legal delivery uh, that's one run right there and there it is yet another 50 33 deliveries 151.5 strike rate are you having that oh my goodness <laughs> Now that is a thing of beauty. How do you even deal with that as a bowler and as a captain? That is just unbelievable. Uh-oh. Well, Kano is uh, testing his luck a bit. He was uh, trying to be a bit cute like he was with the previous shot, and it worked, let's be honest. But uh, it's not going to work too many times now, is it? Uh, he's trying it a second time. He's getting ahead of himself. And, well, he's gone. Gone for 58 of 42. Yet another 50 for him. Uh, yes, he did miss out, so it won't be three in a row. But uh, do keep in mind that third game, he was not out. So he would have gotten a 50 if he was still out there. But uh, it doesn't matter. They won the game. That's all that matters. Sunrisers have called for tails this time. Second match against Rajasthan Royals. Heads it is. Steve Smith have won the toss. What will he choose to do? Well, well, well. It is bowling. So he will choose to bowl first day. All righty then. Kano comes at the bit. His average is above 30 now, all thanks to... Oh, wow, okay. That should have been taken. He hasn't taken it. Lovely. Keno will take the boundary. Don't think he's complaining. Um, so I shouldn't either. Oh, that's a shot and a half. Uh, well, it's definitely worth at least two shots or half a shot. One and half. 90 meters long. Brilliantly done. Maximum result. What else do you want? Maybe some biscuits. Because, uh, you know, I'm kind of hungry at the moment. But that's all right. In cricket terms, that's the best you can do, is smash it over the rope for six runs. Ready then, 50 vanish up between uh, Pandey and Kano. After a very long time, Kano, by the way, batting alongside someone other than David Warner. And again, deft touch. I called it daft touch earlier. Um, <laughs> there's a fine line between those two words. But yeah, <laughs> we're very well done. Here we go. Oh, now that's more like daft touch. Um, <laughs> that's got one bounce and four runs. Kano will take it, though. And uh, 49 is on. Oh, yes, indeed. Three ideals. And that's an upper decker. That's not coming back. Well, 132. What a way to bring up your half time. 43 deliveries, he's done it in two sixes. Yep. Brilliantly done. Outside edge was a bit early on that one. And we'll race away to the boundary for four. Lovely jabbly, mate. Like I said, fortune favors the bold. Yep. And uh, while Kano is not that bold, talking about his physical appearance, uh, his mental uh, abilities uh, certainly very bold. That's the end of that innings. Manavora and Jaiswal to open a batting for Rajasthan. And will they chase this one down? Oh, it's looking like a good one. I think they've chased it down. Oh, no. Yes, they have. So Royals have won by five wickets. And, uh, yeah, things aren't looking too good. A couple, of game, a couple of wins for Sunrisers, but a few losses for them as well. So they're pretty much bang in the middle of the table at the moment. And that is, uh, well... It's good enough to qualify, but uh, we've got to win some more games. Uh, that's the point I'm trying to make. Uh, so I've, uh, or Kano, have got a few 50s now on hardest difficulty. Do not forget that. Will he get another one here? 52 runs required. I doubt he'll get a 50 here since Warney is on strike and he likes to hog the strike. Hogger, his name should be David Hogger instead of Warner. Well, we don't have to worry about him hugging the strike because Kano have given up his strike. He's gone for just nine of six. Brilliantly done, <laughs> That's all right, it happens. We can't all get 50s every game. Uh, oh, look at that. Brilliant. Sunrisers have that about have won the game by eight wickets. David Warner yet again with another 50. 76 not out. David Warner and Kane Williamson are pretty much carrying Sunrise's Heather Abad at the moment. Virat Kohli, King Kohli, who is whom we'll be facing off against Royal Bangalore, Royal Challengers Bangalore. There we go, finally got the name right. Uh, they've scored quite a few runs. The opening batsman put up a lot of runs, didn't he? Yeah, 95 or something, something like that. Kano's turn to bat. His average is creeping up, up and away. 
Lovely shot over cover. That'll be four runs. Thanks for coming, ladies and gentlemen. All right. Six of three, 200 strike rate. I think we can do better. And we have done exactly that. Better, 112 meters long. We're chasing down about 200 runs. So we need to hit a couple of big ones like that. And Kano knows exactly how to do that. Lovely flick of the wrist into the gap. Look at the flick of the wrist. It's four runs. Uh-oh, mistake. A huge one, baller. Look at that. That's not coming back. That's gone over the roof and out of the stadium. 122 meters long, 128 meters long. Umpire, get the box of balls out because you're going to need a new one. Why? Because Kane Williamson is on strike. That's right, bitches. Watch out. It's Kano. Look at that. That's actually gone out of the stadium. Wow. Look at that. That is brilliant. I was just chatting shit, but it's actually gone out. Three ideals. This time I decided to keep it on the ground. And four runs, all the same. Uh, okay, not a great idea, but it's actually worked out. So... Brilliant. We'll take a couple there. Oh, okay. That's not a great throw back. It's 50 runs, 33 deliveries, 151.5 strike rate. Didn't matter because Royal Challengers Bangahore have, I mean, Lower have uh, uh, <laughs> won the game. Sunrisers have a bad. Uh, now taken on DC and the skipper is Aksar Patel. Why? Because Cricket 19, isn't it? Um, yeah, <laughs> I've won the toss and chosen to have a bat first. Okay, well, I guess you don't need me then, Sunrisers, because we need about 18 more runs, and now you bring me out to bat. So I'm going to get about one run, I mean one ball, and I'm going to make the most of it. There he goes, and there she goes. Four runs, brilliantly done, Kato. Keep it up. Get as many runs as uh, we can. The scores are level. Uh-oh, he's bold. A full end delivery. He's gone for it. And he's not cleared him. Ah, oh, scheisse. So, um, <laughs> scores are level. He's lost a wicket. Yeah, when I saw that blue marker, my eyes went red. I wanted blood. Uh, well, I got blood, but it was my own blood, not someone else's. And I would have preferred someone else's. But, uh... You know, you know, you can plan things, but it doesn't always go according to the plan, unfortunately. It's all right, though. We've still won the game, and that's all that matters. Sunrise Heather Bad have won by seven wickets, putting them in a good position. But still, we have to keep pressing forwards because we're still bang in the middle of the table, which is just good enough, uh, you know, to qualify the next round. But, uh, you know, we cannot lose, uh, we cannot get complacent, is what I'm saying. We are tied on points, uh, and we're just ahead on uh, net run rate. So, yeah, Kano, you've got to turn it on. First delivery from Mitch Santner. Bloop, bloop, bloop. That is exactly, oh my goodness. I thought that was going to be a four. That's not a four. That was nearly a catch. He's dropped it. Brilliantly done. I'll give you the 50 after the game, all right? Um, don't tell anyone. Um, yeah, brilliant. Two more run. Ooh, that was a close one, but he survived. David, he's a wily one. Okay, now on 10, I mean, on four of three. He's gone for that same area again. Finally, he's uh, found the gap and found the rope. First boundary of the day for Kano. Brilliantly done. He's gone in the same area again. Is he going to find the rope this time? Is he? Is he? Oh, yeah, betcha. He's got it. Four runs. Yep. Lovely. He's gone there again. Going to find the rope again. I think he has just done so. Yes, he has. Brilliantly done. Kano has really turned it on. Likes betting against the... Uh-oh. 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 That has been heaved away. Fielder, you've ain't got a chance in stopping that one, mate. Lovely. Keeping it grounded. Oh, way too wide. Straight to the fielder. Another drop catch. You know what? I very much appreciate that. That is two lifelines given to Kano now. But I will just swiftly ignore that as Kano gets his 50 or 40 deliveries. Not a great day for Kano. Let's be honest. He's had better. But let's hope uh, Sunrise and Heather Abad uh, win the game somehow still. They 
struggled a bit. Okay, good. One run. Oh my goodness. By just one run, we have somehow clinched victory from the jaws of defeat. Heads it is. Mitch Marsh. I'm going to say your name properly because I want you to make a proper decision. Okay, good. Batting fest. That's what I wanted. You have made a proper decision. So it does work. If you just ask nicely, they'll do it. You know what I'm saying? Actually, is a, a magic word, you know? Please. But, uh, doesn't always work, but uh, well, that's magic for you. Anyways, there we go. Lovely look at the rest over the inner circle. Four runs. A another one. Yep, EJ Cal or uh, DJ Williamson actually. Uh, lovely shot over mid off. Four runs. Eh? Sandeep takes him on. Good shot. Why is Sandeep's highlight in this video? I'm not entirely sure, but here it is. Four runs. Eh? First runs of the day for him. Now it's Kano's turn. Full toss. Ah, okay. So see, if you don't time it well, um, then yeah, you're not going to get much. But, uh, I mean, you've got to time it well. Come on, you're playing on the hardest difficulty. You can't just, they can't just give you a free six, you know. They can give you a free hit, but not a free six. Uh-oh, it's a close one. It's a close one. Oh, he's made it back. Lovely dive. Love it. Love the hustle. 36 of 32. He's gone a bit slow. And I have a feeling, I have a feeling. Anyways. Now that's going to be a 4, which it is. 50 partnership up. And that's going to help his uh, strike rate. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, he somehow cleared the fielder. How in the hell has he done that? Well, it's happened. So uh, let's move swiftly past it. He's flicked it again off his pads. Oh, wow. That fielder is shite. Oh, wow. Okay. 50 up of 37 deliveries. I'll take it. Kano will take it. Why are we complaining? And there he goes again. Over the... Um, square left fielder and beats the deep forward mid wicket is that what it's called i think so <laughs> he's gonna flick it again no oh, he likes flicking it lovely jabbly i bet the missus loves it when he flicks it but look at that lovely feeling on the rope by the way okay uh i don't know who that is i, I thought i knew who that was but yeah, now you're just somebody that I used to know. Oh, wow. Outside edge. Gone. Hey, no. Okay. Um, 68 of 48. 141.7. He's really picked up a pace towards the end of the innings. Because uh, he was struggling at the start. And uh, by he, I mean me. Because, let's be honest, I'm the one who's doing all the work. But, uh... Who won? I wasn't paying attention. Oh, Sunrisers won. Brilliant. So that should help our position because that's two back-to-back -back wins. Definitely should help. Although the first one is not really going to help us with the net run rate because that's what we were beating the uh, team below us by. But I'm hoping they lost their game and so we will be ahead. Kolkata Knight Riders is who we'll be playing against in this one. I don't think I'm going to get 100 unless I get 100 in this game because this is the last game, by the way, and Kano have started it. The only way he knows, well, okay, that's not the only way he knows, but that's the only way I know, let's be honest, because I'm the brute here controlling Kano. Look at that. Oh, lovely. Oh, love to see it. Oh, there it is. There's the daft <laughs> touch. <laughs> Four runs, eh? Whatever works, mate. Whatever works. Who gives a Schweinsteiger? It's a lovely shot over Cavadell before, I think. Yeah, it's definitely for brilliant commentary, in it? Um, yeah, for more professional and top-tier commentary like that, hit that subscribe button in it if you haven't already. I mean, what are you waiting for, really? Let's be honest. Brilliantly done again. That will be one bounce over the rope and four runs. And it's signal four runs as well by the Empire. Man, commentary can get uh, very uh, repetitive and uh, redundant at some time. Like, right there, one bounce over the road for four. I mean, you can see that, so why am I saying it? But I'm saying it anyways, because I don't know why. Well, let's be honest, I mean, you know that that's a four, so why should I say, oh, that's a lovely flick for four runs? Because, I mean, you're looking at it, aren't you? Unless you can't see, in which case, you know, you need the commentary. Is that why there is commentary? I think that might be it. <laughs> I think that might be it. It might be like an aid for, uh, uh, you know, some uh, people. But, uh, yeah, I do it because uh, I like yelling. Uh-oh. Well, that's out. That's definitely out. Caught in front of leg stump. 
I'm not gonna review it. I mean, if I review it, it might be, you know, missing, but I don't think it's gonna be. It's gonna be like clipping, just about clipping it, and it'll be Empire Skull, and Empire Skull always, well, not always, but whatever the Empire Skull is, it remains that, which in this case goes against me. That's the last game. Night Riders have lot, I mean, one, and... Oh. What? So we didn't make it through the next round? I thought we were in fourth. Okay, so here's what happened. We finished fourth, I know that. Oh no, I don't know that, because the team below us was... Oh no, the team below us was KKR, wasn't it? They won, so they are now ahead of us. So we're knocked out. Oh shit, okay. So uh, yeah, well, we didn't win a trophy, because, uh, well, let's be honest, I am playing as Kane Chokers, and I mean Williamson, so uh, we can't be winning all the trophies, let's be honest. But I did my best. Look at that, 14 games I played, six not outs, 558 bloody runs. Are you having that? So nearly 70 average. Um, man. It was too good. But the World Cup, that's what's going to happen in the next uh, episode. I think I'm going to do one game um, in one episode, or maybe two, we'll see. But yeah, we're going to try to... I'm trying to look for the IPL stats, but I guess they're not going to show it to us, because they're a bunch of pricks is what they are. But uh, yeah, we couldn't get him a trophy, but uh, we still have another trophy. We're going to try our hand at it. First game in the next episode will be Sri Lanka. It's not going to be all in one episode like it was in this one. I'm going to break that one down because it is 50 overs. So to do what, how many games? 10 games? Excuse me. Nine games. Uh, 50 over games in one video. That's going to be like a two hour long video. So I'm not going to do that. I might do one or two games like I said already. And uh, if you enjoyed this one, do drop a like, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell. We are going to have a bit of fun. You know, I'm going to say stuff that might piss you off a little bit. But just keep in mind. I'm a daft cunt, so don't take it too seriously. Come on, we're just having fun. And uh, yeah, I mean, if you're still not too happy about some of the things I've said, well, there's this uh, X button in the top right corner of your screen. Feel free to hit it. All right, for everybody else, I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, have a nice...